Oh my gosh, I love Sana's voice for that. Oh, that's such a cool part of the song. Ooh. Oh yeah. Hello everyone, what is going on? My name is the Newbie Warrior and welcome back to my K-pop reaction channel and today we have what is sadly the final uh, of the new Misomo songs. Uh, this is obviously TWICE's uh, subunit, their debut mini album masterpiece. Uh, I've really enjoyed this so far. Uh, we have kind of a dark sexy theme, a lot of R&B influence, a lot of jazz influence, although less so on these uh, member written songs. Um, which has been cool as well. We got something darker and more cinematic. And then Mina, we got uh, Mina's It's Not Easy For You. We got something darker and more uh, guitar-led. Um, still dark, still sexy, but a little bit, but less like jazz influence directly, less R&B influence. Uh, this one is the Sauna written song, Rewind You. I am the most nervous about the song, not because Sauna wrote it, but because of the other people attached to the song, uh, which is The Hub. Uh, the Hub are... Okay. They don't make boring music. <laughs> but so far they have made only music that I absolutely love and music that I absolutely despise. Um, so I I love Venpada. I, I, I know it was probably not good for Weekly and their fan base and their trajectory and everything... As a song, I love that song with all of my heart. One of the most interesting songs of the year. Uh, I, yeah, it's incredible. I'm obsessed with it still. Uh, love the mixing, love the use of drums. Uh, I hate OO. Oh, oh. It's one of my least favorite songs, uh, mixing wise, uh, engineering wise, in all of recent K pop. I think it is the worst song ever released uh, for a JYP girl group. Um, mostly for mixing reasons, for engineering choices. Uh, so, uh, the hub is... But they don't make boring music, they don't make formulaic music. Um, I've never been bored listening to a song that the hub worked on, but I have a very strong emotional reaction to whatever they do musically, typically. So, uh, I have no idea. Prepare yourselves, it's possible I hate this, is what I'm saying, musically. Uh, really hope it's more of a Venpada, um, but uh, I'm just letting you know, there's no middle ground for me in the hub. So, <laughs> so I will either love this or despise it, uh, probably. Rewind, I'm gonna make it rewind it. Rewind, I'm gonna make it rewind it. Rewind, I'm gonna make it rewind it. Okay. It's a good start. It's a really, really good start. Uh, I love the kind of the the second layer vocal, kind of the way it's faded coming in behind Momo. Uh, sounds sounds once again a little bit more like a return to the R and B themes we got for the non uh, member written stuff. Uh, it sounds kind of chill. Sounds kind of vibey. It's a very strong start for me. Rewind, I'm gonna make it rewind it. Rewind, I'm gonna make it rewind it. Rewind, it is more melodic flow, by the way, which, yes, please. Rewind, I'm gonna make it rewind. Oh, that woodblock is so nice. Oh, yeah, this is good. Oh, yeah, this is good. Oh. Oh, the way we're building in this track is crazy. <laughs> oh, we start with just the... Just the chords and the guitar, basically. And then we build in... Uh, the the little wood block. We build in more of the draw. Oh my gosh! Oh yeah! 
Oh, are you kidding me? That snare! That symbol is so nice. Oh! This is actually incredible. <laughs> this is actually incredible. See the hub do they do cool stuff. It's just sometimes I very strongly disagree with the cool stuff. Um ooh this one ooh this speaks to me. This building all the rhythmic stuff is so neat. Wow, we cut everything after that. Whoa! Oh, that's a gorgeous place for Sana's voice. That is, are you kidding me? This is sexy again, by the way. Oh my gosh, I love Sana's voice for that. Oh, that's such a cool part of the song. Ooh. Oh yeah. Oh, big instrumental switch. We keep the core of the symbol. Whoa. What a what a gorgeous descriptive lyric, by the way. Damn. Also, sexy breathy momo. Yes, please. We even cut for the breath, dude. This song is too good. I can't. I can't. Oh. Oh, I die. Momo breathes. I die. We get a little double tap. <laughs> Drop back in. Oh, that little thing. That little triangle. Oh my god! <laughs> the, the the pure slow jam effect of that is crazy. That is crazy. Oh, this is so good. Oh, it's so good. Please do. I'm sorry. They all sound so, so freaking good on this song. <laughs> Make it rewind. Mina, please. The breathy. Oh, oh my gosh. Oh, it's sexy as hell. Those drums are so ice. Oh my god, dude. See, oh, oh it's, it's a banger. It's so good. I love how isolated that is. Ooh, deep. Deep plunge, deep plunge, high note. Um, And then we go back. Oh, dude. Oh, dude.
Oh! Wow! I love that hole. Oh, it's so cool. Oh my god! Oh my, are you serious? That's... <laughs> That's the best song on the album. That's the best song on the album. Um... That's the best song on the album. That is absurdly good. Uh... Yeah, like I said, I mean, the hub, like... It's either the greatest, coolest thing I've ever heard... Or it's it's terrible and annoying, uh, and, and there's no in between. This is the greatest, coolest thing I've ever heard. Category. Uh, this is insane. It's insane. It's insane. Uh, it's sexy. It's super sexy. It's super smooth. Um, just the subtle instrumental changes, the isolations on the drums, on the woodblock, on the triangle, the way these elements get wrapped in and around and through. Um, oh, it's absurd. Gorgeous, sexy, insane. The repeat value on this is insane. Insane. I will be listening to this song every day for like three years, guys. Like, th this is like, oh my gosh. This is the best song on the album. Um, It just is for me. Uh, th this is absurd. And, and I say that as someone that already had Do Not Touch as one of my favorite songs of the entire year. And as someone that loved Behind the Curtain, and loved Marshmallow, and loved Funny Valentine, and loved It's Not Easy For You, uh, this is still somehow the best song on this album. This is, it's gotta be my favorite Japanese release this year. It's gonna end up being one of my most listened to mini albums this year. Uh, this is insane. I can't even do a track ranking right now. I don't know what order everything would be in. All I know is this one's number one. Somehow, some way. Oh, 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 okay, um, jumping into the lyrics behind, uh, wow, 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 Shout out Sana and everybody from the hub that worked on this. Hi, konnichiwa, Ah, so pretty. はい、今回私はマスターピースの中でイワインというコンサケ作ってきました。えっと、日本語での作詞は今回が初めてなんですけど、今回はミサモのアレンジ体が少しダークな感じのコンセプトになっているので、ディギングザダークアルバム。俺
あの思ってたことがあのえっ、ー、と「Cry for Me」っていう曲があるんですけど、yep. トワイスの中に、yep. でその「Cry for Me」での私のパートの歌詞をワンスの皆さんがすごい新鮮なのですごくよく聴いてくださってたと思うんですけど、yep. その感じが好きだと思うんですけど、She sounds incredible on this song. 今回あの出来上がったのが。You are in the you です。Thank you. 今回のアルバムにもミサモが今までじゃ表現できなかった新しい姿もたくさんしてくれて。I love how dark this album is. マスターピース、皆さん楽しみにして。マスターピース、indeed。The most appropriately named album of the year. The masterpiece. Wow, what a song.、Uh, normally, at the end of an album listening like this, I would do a track ranking. I can't yet. I, I don't know. I need time to listen to them. So, what I'm going to do, and there is other stuff I wanted to watch from this. So,、uh, there will be, I will react to the jacket making and the MV making short versions.、Uh, I know it says I've watched it, but all I did was pause it, click around for one frame for the video. Basically, I was looking for this shot. For the thumbnail,、um, I will react to the masterpiece jacket shooting and I'll react to the making short version. So, in that video, which will be coming soon, TM, in the next couple of days,、uh, in that video, I will also do my track ranking for the album. It'll give me a day or two to listen to it. So,、uh, I genuinely don't know what order this album will be in because I just love so many of these songs. Do Not Touch, Behind the Curtain. Funny Valentine, It's Not Easier for You, and Rewind You are all incredible and top tier to me.、Uh, Bouquet is pretty, i t definitely feels like a bonus track, which is fine. It definitely feels like a pretty bonus track on this album. I liked it when it came out. It's a pretty song.、Um, and Marshmallow is fun. It's almost too chill for me. I do like it, but I, will, I do see myself listening to it less than the rest of the songs on this album. But I do want to listen to this as an album and give. Give myself a couple of days before I do that track ranking. So I do plan to, to release、uh, the track ranking. It's just coming when you guys see the making,、uh, the MV behind and, and that stuff, the, the jacket behind. That video will be my track ranking.、Um, this is incredible. The album is appropriately named.、Uh, this will probably end up being my most listened to mini album this year, unless Twice put, puts something else out insane or Geo puts something else out insane.、Um, I love the dark vibes. I love the sexiness of it. I love the jazz influence that's in a lot of it.、Uh, it's insane. They all sound so good. I get so much rapper Momo.、Um, and、uh, yeah, as far as Rewind You goes, just as a song,、uh, the hub c o n t i n u e to be always interesting. And sometimes I hate it. And sometimes it's amazing. And it was amazing here. So. Thank you. Let me know in the comment section what your ranking would look like.、Um, and、uh, yeah, thank you. My name's Anubi Warrior, twice best girls.、Uh, we will be, like I said, reacting to the showcase at some point soon, TM.、Uh, I will announce it in a community post on YouTube like the day before or something, so you guys know. Thank you. My name's Anubi Warrior. I love twice. I love me some more. And、uh, this album's amazing. Thank you so much to everyone who has chosen to support me on Patreon, with special gratitude being extended to Daniel Reigns, Muse Ribbons, Lucky7Gen, 42Ariadna, Atsushi Ray H, Mushroomy, and Wolkbook. 